they came to my photo shoot for Selecta because my talent there was really walang humpa, walang opening. So, muna, I was humbled because they were asking me to go there. And, um, si Kuya Don, I was kind of intimidated at first because I was working with the director in a commercial. Nung araw pa. Pero yun lang naman, isang buong araw kami magkasama. Masaya na ako. But you all know I've always wanted to do a horror movie. I've been wanting to for many years. At laging merong hinahanda yung Viva, hindi natutuloy. May hinahanda kami ng star, hindi natutuloy. Um, you know, they just came, kinuwento ni Direk, nag-usap kami. In like, mahaba na yung 15 minutes. Wala na, I was in. I'm in. Sabi ko. So, I got my schedule right away, nandun. And after that, wala pang one month yata, nagsishoot na kami. And it was from, I have to say lang, from beginning to end, although it was um, one of the most, I've done what, 57, 56, 57 movies. Um, it was one of the most physically, mentally, and emotionally draining experiences I've ever had uh, and movies I've ever done. But it was such a happy set. Yeah. It was direct. It's such a happy film. Yeah. And they were like, I am, I was so, mother, mama, I was so impressed by, thank you, I was so impressed by the whole reality team. It was such an efficient staff, such a wonderful crew, na parang, parang silang army. Yung, kami may pahinga tayong mga artista. Ewan ko ikaw, wala kang pahinga hindi gusto. Kasi pag gali na sa Baguio, uuwi, magpapabrin siya, no? The next day, balik siya sa Baguio. Lala ang ginawa, hobby niya yun, ipahirapan sa atin niya. Pero, lahat ng energy na doon pag kailangan. So, it was, actually, I told Kuya Don doon na, I'm older than him, but I call him Kuya out of respect. It was such an honor and a privilege to work for reality. Thank you so much for all the respect, the great project, and the great shooting experience. Thank you so much. Everybody was so... That is how parang, your whole crew and staff, direct, nasa sa'yo yun, di ba? Nasa director yun, ikaw kapitan. Very impressive, dahil na rin sa'yo. So, I was so at home because that is the way I want to do things. Efficiently and, you know, there's no waste of time. It's it's so, and everyone's, parang pati sila yung character. <laughs> Pero napakasaya namin. Parang walang maingay, walang, lahat nagtatrabaho. Pero pag take, lahat, you, uh, I can't say enough good, uh, good things about reality. Na ako na yung presenta ko yung Dondo, pwede kahit once a year makarealize ko. Hindi kahit pagkating ng araw pa yung picture ko, sarili ko, pwede na ako artista, magtatrabaho ko sa rapel, hindi makikikofro. No, but truly, from the bottom of my heart, and as God is my witness, one of the very best companies I've ever worked with. Thank you so much. And Shanta, my director. Thank you very much. Thank you for everything I learned from you today. Grabe. Thank you so much. Thank you. Niya pang mga sa mga kaibigan natin sa press na si Sharon is a horror fan talaga. Ay, walang lumulusot sa akin. She can quote the exorcist word for word. Father Caras, si Juan. Memorize niya, totoo. At nga, napula niyo siya mamaya para mag-sample. I've been a horror fan since I was a little girl. Kasi lalo pag natatalo yung bad. 
<laughs> oh, parang talaga, it's, you know, it's may spiritual warfare talaga. Eh. So, yun ang nirequest ko talaga ko kayo doon at, at, at direct Eric the first time we met. Sabi ko, kung pwede lang po, because I'm a Christian, parang gusto ko lang panalo talaga si Lord. <laughs> so, <laughs> ayaw ka lang, yun lang ang aking hiningi na swak na swak talaga direct. <laughs> Okay, thank you, Sir. Tangin ko muna yung producers ba o kung tayo yung ibang class. So, Sir Don, how does it feel working with Sharon and Duro? Kaya pa, nakita niyo na itong ano? Uh, ilang parts ng forest? Napanood niyo! Oh, how does it feel? It's always an honor to work with uh, Megastar. Mm -hmm. Talagang hinahanap ko naman yan. Totoo yun, pinuntaan namin siya ni Eric sa show. Mm -hmm. Diba, talagang siya ang number one choice namin. Yung mga iba talaga, malayo na. Para mayroon ko kung matutuloy yung project ko, kung nag-no siya doon sa project na sa ito. Kasi yung nag-usap kami ni Eric, talagang uh, we had her in our mind. All the way. Diba? Tapos sa... Uh, si Tom? Si Tom ito? Yes, I know. Si Tom ito, lagi, pag magsisimula kami ng movie, gawa tayo maliit. Yan yung sinasabi. <laughs> Sa tik-tik, sinabi niya, gawa tayo maliit. Big lang sa tulo. Sasabihin niya, sabihin niya, gawin natin puro green screen. So, hindi na sa maliit ngayon, di ba? Kunin natin si Ding Dong. Kunin natin si Ganito. Palaki na ng palaki. Ito rin, nagsimula lang to. Two weeks na yung shooting. Oo, shooting tayo sa Baguio, malamig, December. Pag-akyat natin, pagkatapos ng dalawang linggo, baba tayo, buo na yung pelikula. Eh, o sige, two days later, eh kung si Sharon na tayo. Eh kung mag-Sharon na tayo sa movie. <laughs> <laughs> Sabi ko, hindi na yan two weeks to. <laughs> Madugo na na pelikula yan. Laki na, lumaki na yan. Pwede na pwede in and out na lang yan. Pinanood nila, wala pa yung mga 
mga demonyo, wala pa mga ghost effect, wala pa. Wala pa music. Okay. Wala pa scoring. Thank you, friend. Thank you, Drek. Uh, Tali ko muna yung mga kasama sa class. Ano experience na rito at ano na rin role mo? Kila, ano role mo rito? Kasama ko sa magsisino ka ngayon. Okay. Ten years okay. Ako, ako, sige, na pa na yan. Ako po si Sandy. Ikaw uh, yung ay babae ng list na yun sa... Yes. Okay. Ako ang magigay kulay. Sa video. Ako yung video. So, ako yung video. So, Dati ako large. Kung wala ka, wala ka. <laughs> Correct. Kung um, wala ako, wala yung video. Sa akin yung story. <laughs> How ako? How's, how's the experience working with the three? Um, wait. Pamaya na si Derek. So, okay. Diyan. Ayan. May, may si Sini yung video. Si... Wala ka. Yes. Yes. Si Kila, hindi na nag-artista to si Kila. Corporate, corporate na si Kila. But I was looking for a contrapunto sa dalawang sobrang intense na artista. So I, I was looking for somebody cool, manginginong, mangdating. <laughs> Pero hindi naman siya manginginong. <laughs> Yung cool ba? Yon. So I thought of Gila. Gila, we used to work together. I used to teach uh, ABS uh, na Star Circle. We were together for three years na workshop sa Star, sa Star Magic. And I remembered si Gila and I knew she wasn't acting anymore. Pero hinanting ko talaga si Gila kasi pag tinignan mo talaga in the movie, ang ganda ng chemistry nilang tatlo kasi siya yung medyo cool. Si Sharon is really this motherly, intense, emotional. Uh, and then si Jan, of course, is really, really scary. <laughs> <laughs> scary is the girl. And then you have a really fresh talent with Ken and Pam. Na, grabe, itong si Ken, na, ang first scene niya si Sharon, homecoming, iyakan. Wala siyang, wala siyang moment, hindi to artista, hindi siya nagti-TV. Na, lumabas siya sa ilang commercials, pero hindi, wala siyang parang mahabang eksena. Usually sa mga pag-uwang artista, pag mahaba yung eksena, nagpapanik na kung anong gagawin, di ba? Siya hindi. Di ba? Unang scene pa lang nila, silang dalawang magkasama. Hindi siya. Oh my God! Or magpapa. Oh. Yes. Anyway. Sorry. Balik yes. Um, so, with John, um, it was a dream. Actually, when I stopped kasi show business 20 years ago, yes, I went back to school. <laughs> so, nakikita ko lang si John sa movies and I would watch. And I was like, magaling, magaling pong artista na to. At sayang hindi ko naabutan. Hindi ko nakatrabaho. And then, eto na. Umating na rin yung dream. And then with Megastar, of course, nakatrabaho ko siya before, maging sino ka man. Chika-chika. As a? Oo, as a 10-year-old. <laughs> ang pangalan ko si Peck. Peck. Huwag natin alamin kung gusto. Ito sa mga kasama ni Robin. Oo, oh, so kami yung mga alam ni Robin. So anyway, nung inintroduce ako ni, ni Derek kay Sharon, uh, Sharon si Gila, and then she gave me the stare, na parang, I know this face, and hindi ko akalain na makikilala niya ako. Because it was... 20 years ago. I don't know. I have the memory of an elephant and the body. No more. Then I said to her, I worked with you before, but I was 10 years old. And then she said, Gila? I said, yes. I said, I'm only 25 years old. I'm only 25 years old. I'm only 25 years old. I said, yes. 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 And then yun na nga, with direct naman, bigla na yung may nakuha akong text. Pinibit ka. Parang, Eric Mati. Sabi niya, Gina, just hear me out. Sabi ko, direct, hindi pwede corporate na ako. Hindi na ako sa showbiz. Just hear me out. So, okay, Chris, kaya yun. Masa dito? Ang corporate? Sa mga showbiz. Na-miss ko nga siya. So yun, I went to have coffee with him. And then yun, the same, kunento niya sa akin. And gusto gusto ko na mag-yes kagad, but at the same time, because I work corporate, kailangan ko mag-yes, kailangan ko paalam sa boss ko. Um, so, para, sige, pahala na, game. Gumula na lang ako, game. Tara, gumusta tayo? Okay na. 
Tapos hindi pa actually tapos kami mag-usap, tumatawag na si Stacy Basco. Basta <laughs> schedule mo. Sorry, Sabi ko, ang bilis na ba? Hello? Sabi niya, yes, yes. Stacy, ganyan. Um, gusto ko lang kausapin kung ano yung schedule, budget. Ha? Sa tingin lang, nakayos ko pala. Magkasama pa pa kami ni Derek. Do not dare, Derek. Grabe, ang bilis talaga nung, ang bilis ng kumpanya nila. Ganyan talaga ng reality. Pag yung photo, pa. So, feeling ko si Fritzy yung nag-text, game na daw si Miss Mira. So, ayun. It was, it was very nice. It's, um, I never thought it was gonna be this big na kailangan may press call. Kasi hindi na ako sanay. Sabi niya, maliit lang eh. Parang gamit ka pitch. Hindi, parang gamit ka pitch. Parang gamit ka pitch. Parang gamit ka pitch. Tapos, hindi lang nandito ako nakaupo. So, anyway, yes, but, you know, I, no regrets that I said yes on that day. I will never forget that uh, time we had coffee. Maraming salamat, kinulit mo ako. Buti pa kayo nakapagkakaroon. Eh, eh, malapag kalapit mo namin pa. Kasi nagtagasahot kami eh. So, okay na gawin. So anyway, yun, maraming maraming salamat direct. It was a nice experience. Salamat pala. Saka salamat direct sa...